Hello there, Taurus. How's it going? Hope you enjoyed your last month. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed this month, too. How's it going? Let's see what's going on. This is, uh, this is for this week, um, you know, this holiday season. And I want to see what's going on. I'm sure you do, too. So let's get right into it and start pulling some runes. Ooh, interesting. The blank rune. <laughs> I see many of you, well, another sign. I can't remember which one it was, but they started off with the blank rune as well. Um, usually when that comes up, it's something, uh, usually uh, some sort of a decision, some delicate decision that you haven't made up yet. So... Anyway, that's what usually what that means. But we'll find out as we get along here. I'm going to grab the card for that. There we go, the blank room. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's pull another one. Ah, cool. Othala. Othala. And this is another rune that's been coming up a lot, especially during the holiday season. Um, and the reason why is because it, it represents family. And, you know, a lot of you guys are going to be um, with your family. Um, and if you, you know, are far away from your family, at least you're going to be talking to them on the phone or something. There it is right there. Othala. And you know, family is always there for support too, you know. Yeah. Let's grab another one here. Ooh, cool. This is a very good one here, guys. Jera. Jera. So Jera is... Um, Jer is one of them runes that um, it's it's hard work and success from hard work. So that's earned success. So whatever you're doing, um, whatever you're doing, Taurus, keep doing it. This is this is great. This is a earned success. Um, could be uh, you know extra money. Everybody likes a little extra money. <laughs> Let's pull another one here. Hmm. Gable. Gable. And of course, you're going to get that on the holiday season too. That's kind of it's kind of obvious that it's kind of weird that that would come up, but, you know, I guess it's not. It is the holiday season. Gabo is a, is a rune uh, that means receiving gifts, you know, giving and receiving gifts. So, of course, that's going to pop up for the holiday season, isn't it? <laughs> Merry Christmas, you guys. All right. So, anyway, um, yeah. That's very, very good. Giving and receiving gifts. Um, yep. This is a really good one here. This is earned success. So I like that. Let's get another one here. Get last one here. <laughs> okay, Thoraz. So Thoraz, that's a thorn, by the way. And it is pointing towards you. It's not in reverse. So, what this is telling me, let me find the card for that here. That's what I thought. That's the first first thing that came to my mind was when I pulled up that blank green there. Thoraz. Okay. So, this looks like a typical 
you know, like a typical holiday season for most people, you know, you got your family, you got gifts, you know. Um, this here, though, is is really good. You're working on something, and it's, it, you, you know, you, that's earned success. That could be extra money for you guys. Um, and then with this blank rune, this is what gets me here, is this blank rune here, and then Thoraz over here. And this is saying that you've got some sort of a, a decision to make and it, it's it's really delicate it's a you know you want to be you want to you want to uh, you know make this decision you know give it full consideration you know what I mean you want to evaluate it really really clearly and carefully go through with it because you know you've got that thorn there so you don't want to get poked so you want to you want to, you know, thoroughly evaluate every aspect of the situation before making your move. And, uh, yeah, other than that, I think, you know, I think that'll be fine. Um, I just noticed some synchronicities, you know, maybe some of you guys are feeling a little bugged. Um, but don't worry, this, this here indicates that that's going to go away, too. This is also indicates that. Um, let me, uh, let me pull a, an oracle card here. So this is what I pulled here, Taurus. I pulled a horn cactus, and that kind of like uh, got me with the synchronicity because I seen a little teeny baby ant running across here, and that's really kind of not normal. So I mean, I don't know how the little the little devil got in here, but it, it, it's a synchronicity with your reading. I just kind of seen it when I was doing your reading. So many of you may be feeling a little bit bugged about something, but now this uh, particular uh, card is really good. This is the horn cactus, and with the horn cactus, um, I think this is tied in with this over here with Jera. It's it's very residual, and it's got very, very, very deep roots. And so even though it's in a very harsh environment, it's got such deep roots that it, it can always have water and it thrives. It thrives in a really harsh environment. And, um, and that's what's really cool about the horned cactus because, you know, it's just, it's telling you to be, you know, to be residual, you know, to, uh, you know, to adapt to, you know, certain circumstances. Um, it's, you know, the, the horn cactus is protected. It's got thorns around it, too. So, I mean, it's thriving in a, in a, in a, you know, in a place that, you know, most things would not thrive. And that's what that card is actually asking you to do. And keep doing what you're doing here, too. This is great, great, great news. <laughs> All right, Taurus? All right, I hope you enjoyed your reading. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys again next time. All right, bye for now.